Hey guys, what's up? Uh, before we get into the straight to the video, I just want to say that day, uh, the video you're about to watch right now, I reviewed four plus knives that day, and it was a long day of work. So in all, uh, I butchered the name of this trainer, uh, the Squint In Industries Nautilus. I called it the Dentalius. Yeah, so anyways, I just want to say that right now. Uh, I know I messed up the name of the trainer. Uh, I know what it's called. It's called the Nautilus, not the Natalius. So anyways, hope you guys enjoy and uh, on with the video. What's up guys, got a very back with another boxing and this is the fourth package out of the five packages that came today. And uh, you know, we started with the most expensive one and then we went to another pale, and then we went to the full dress JK Emissary, which was <laughs> And then uh, um, now we're gonna go into what I want for flipping, you know? And uh, the back line is what, I mean, that's the best flipper I'm, I got. I mean, let's just say that right now. I mean, let's get into it, guys. So this is the Squint Industries. Now this is the first Squint Industry product that I have owned. Um, I have tried the V, uh, the, the regular, Squid trainers from uh, Blaze Show East. I tried the V3. I thought it was very smooth, but who knows? They they probably uh, did differences with it now. Excuse me. And uh, I tried the uh, you know the squiddies and stuff. And uh, I can't remember them too much about the squiddies and how they felt, but I know they were light um, just because it's plastic. But uh, then they came out with their new one called the Natalius. I think it's called Natalius. I think it's called that. Natalius, uh, I think that's how you say it. So, but anyways guys, let's get into it. So, this is how it was when I first opened it. Um, you know, we got the um, amazing dude. I forgot his name, but I. what's funny is guys, is that remember when I got my first 42? Remember? A while back. So, uh, but guess what? Guess who bought it? You're looking at him. Yeah. I did a deal with him. And I didn't know he was this big player at the time, but now I know. Well, I've known for a while now, and it's like, holy shit. <laughs> I uh, did a deal with a big time player in the community and uh, just want to say thank you, man. This is actually pretty cool. As well, I want to say thank you to my cousin for uh, giving me such a gift. Go follow him at his Instagram link. I mean, shown right here. Uh, you know, it'd be great. And, uh, you know, he, he's looking for anybody with knives, you know, for ideas. So uh, anyways, go follow him and uh, thanks again, brother. So let's get into it. Uh, we got the Squint Industries sticker, which is pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna be using it on something, I don't know yet, but uh, it's actually pretty cool. I do dig, the, dig this card, uh, made in the USA, pretty nice. Um, California, you know, Squid Master, one of the BRS legends, I think, you know, from the friend group of Jersey Devil, Knife Zoid, uh, all those sick guys. But uh, yeah, no, I flipped it a bit, and I just gotta say I liked it. I really do, uh, and it's cool. It came with uh, you know a microfiber, micro, a microfiber cloth sheath, which is pretty sick. And uh, let's get into it. I mean, very nice. I mean, I really enjoyed flipping this last night. Um, yes, I got it last night. Um, very nice. I mean, the Natalius guys. I mean, it's G10. It's full uh, channel. Uh, not full channel, but it is channel aluminum, I think, and it has G10 uh, slabs smack dad sandwiched together. So I like the design. I think it's pretty cool. And this is their first Tain Pin, I believe, excuse me for my finger, uh, Tain Pin system uh, from Squint Industries, I believe. I don't think there has been one since this. So. Um, not too for sure, but this is my first squid product. And I gotta say, you know, I love, I like their products. I mean, I love their products, but I like BRS more. Um, so far, every squid I flipped, it's either too light and there's not enough like uh, handle 
weight to them. I mean, yeah, I get it's aluminum, but uh, this thing flips amazing, you know? And I would pick one of these up rather than a Benchmade 51. I'd rather pick this up rather than a Bare Bones V1 or V2, you know? Um, what else is really good? I'd rather pick this up than uh, a Tropos Demon, you know? It flips better than all those, in my opinion. This flips better than all those. So get one, guys. I mean, the Natalius is really cool. I mean, it's their newest idea on the market right now. Um, besides, like, what else? The Kraken. I think it was Natalius, then Kraken. I'm not too for sure. Or Kraken, then Natalius. I'm not too for sure on it. But um, this is their newest trainer, I should say, uh, that they created. And I think it's really cool. Anyways, guys, this is awesome. And uh, so, yeah, they did chamfer the spine. It's not rounded, as you can see. Okay, let's just... It is chamfered. It's not rounded, you know, like the back line, for instance. I mean, the crown is rounded. Whoopsies. So, you guys can just tell, but the Natalia's is a great flipper for the price. I mean, the there is play. Once you uh, flip it and stuff a bit, there is play. Not too bad, not too much. I mean, there's no play on that handle. Whew. The play, I mean, the top, uh, the plant handle play is, you know, bearable. I mean, it's pretty good. It's not too bad. But yeah, I mean, the Natalia Squid Chinner, guys, very nice. I love that little logo right there. It's very cool. Um, this trainer is one of the best trainers I think you can buy compared to the Chinoy. And uh, I guess I'm not a real boys trainer which in my opinion, kind of looks like the Chonoi a little bit, but I mean, I haven't tried one of his new trainers, so we'll see how it goes. I don't know if I'll get one, but um, you know, I'm not a trainer guy, I use live blades, but this is for flipping, you know, around family, um, you know, and uh, places where you can't flip, for instance. So um, anyways, I do like this Natalius. It's very cool. And I recommend getting one just because it's the best knife you can buy at the price, 210 bucks for this. Um, that standard one. This is the most standard you can get. This is the standard. This is the OG. So there's nothing cool about it. It's not an Arctic one. It's not, you know, a spooky one. It's not, you know, colored. It's just a regular. So I don't mind. I don't care for colors. I'm not going to pay an extra money just for have a bright color. You know what I'm saying? Especially for the $200 value. But um, anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, the Natalia's is pretty cool. My first squid product ever. Um, I dig it. They do a great job, you know. Uh, I can already tell they're a big ass company. They do really well, um, you know, for the kids that want to uh, get trainers and guys for beginners into the sport that want to get into flipping and, you know, don't want to cut themselves, which I understand. But, you know, the live blade is the best way to go, in my opinion. Yeah, you're going to get cut, but that's how you learn. Just like how you make mistakes, you learn from your mistakes. So, it's my opinion. But, anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, the Squid Industry is Natalius. Very excited to have this and own one. So anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video and as always, peace out.